We got another unboxing today. Holy cow. This thing is in a big box. This is how it shipped from Amazon. What in the world? Well, what's up guys? And if you're new here, my name is Paul and I run a channel that inspires other creators that your future is whatever you make it. And I do that through gear reviews, tutorials, and whew, we got a big old unboxing today. This is what it came like for Amazon, insane. If you like videos like this, feel free to hit that subscribe button, that bell notification. I do unboxings, filmmaking tutorials, all that jazz. And uh, today, more lights. Because lights are so important. Lights are huge. And these are some RGB light kit that I found on Amazon. <clears throat> and you know me, I love I love me some RGB. Oh. <laughs> this huge box. This huge box for this little bag. Sometimes I just don't really understand Amazon. All right. But another Wii Light. I love their bags, man. They got some good little bags. I'm excited about this one. All right, nice little case. So it comes with two lights. And they're really small. They they remind me of like the Yong Nuo like 600. So little panel lights. They're RGB. They're pre-diffused. Good old Chinese goodies. How do you get into? Oh, so the lights are stored there. You flip it upside down and this is where the stands are stored. So it's like a, I like this bag a lot. I feel like I'd use this bag for other things. And you got two light stands and the power supplies for the lights. We'll need those, that's good. So you got two power supplies, a remote and two ball heads and then two light stands all in this like nice carrying case let's get them powered up and turned on and just see what you get out of the box with these bad boys and of course we're gonna link them up with an app all right we got power we got power so I like these lights because they have battery options and power that's really nice to include something like that so we've got a dial on the back that does the intensity. It also is pressed down to go th to the different thing, like fast, your different scenes. Um, that's really cool. And once again, we gotta go to the app. It's, it's on some sort of a fire scene right now. Uh, channel two, all right. <laughs> and see how quickly that link, I literally just opened this up out of the box made sure the channel was set to the right thing in the app and we're going on here to do this this is pretty cool we got regular basic color modes this thing is bright this is 100 percent right now let's just pull this back down to about 48 percent all right we're in cte mode so you got 3000 kelvin 4000 kelvin 5200 kelvin 5500 kelvin um, and then you can go all of like 8,000, so it should be really cool looking. Like, cool, like not, yeah. Anyway, then you got, uh, I love that you have for these RGB lights, just the full RGB spectrum. Oh, shoot, it's linking with my key light. 
Oh, that's hilarious. All right, so that was a little tricky, but we I finally figured it out. So when you're powering these on for the first time, in order to get these any of these wee lights, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down the, hold down the knob, turn the light on, and then it's gonna get, get you to the spot where you can select what channel, and you press the, the knob in again, and it goes to what group. So I have this light set to channel two, group B, and my key light here, my this ring light, that's the same exact brand, is set to channel two, group A. So now that that's set, then you just hold the button knob down again, and the light will boot back up. Now, this allows me to have full control, and the app still works great. So as you can see here, we're back into the app, and now I'm controlling A is this key light right here. So if I wanted to you know, increase my light, there we go. So we'll just bring it back down to 75%. And now I'm gonna go to group B, which these lights are on. And right now it's going through like a, a flashing scene. Woo! And it's really bright at 100%, and it's just going through all the different colors. That's pretty cool. You can choose the intensities like fast, slow, and the cool thing about these lights is these, I believe the ring light can't do some of these. So like, I don't believe the ring light can do the fireworks, but these panels can do these fireworks things. So they share the same app, but not all the functions in the app are available in every single light. This is pretty cool. So these lights are actually pretty bright. Uh, TV, pretty awesome. Weld. Looking like I'm welding something. Got an alarm. Their police car. And then you got your, you know, just regular solid colors in here for just quick access. Um, as well as, you know, you could go back to the HSI and have the full RGB circle. You can just go through and select exactly what color you want. You got the best color in the world green. You know, you got some yellow, reds, some purples and pinks, um, blues, and teal. I mean, this this light has got it all. And the nice thing is they're really bright and they don't take up a lot of space. So, you know, you are paying for it a little bit, but you also get the wonders of having a remote control. On the remote, you gotta hold down the channel button till the channel flashes. You select what channel you want, and then when you just tap, once you get back to the main screen, you just tap the group button and you cycle through all the different groups. So now I'm on this and I can actually control you know, the, the brightness of this light and the dimness of this light through the remote in case you don't like using your phone. I prefer using the phone, especially for these RGB lights. But if you were setting these up as a key light and you just wanted a quick way just to you know, increase the temperature and all that stuff, you could do it on this. I just find it a lot easier you know, just to use this as on and off, and they group them together. See how my key light went out there for a second. Same uh, same channel, but different group. Now, if you wanted to select them differently, then you'd put them on different channels, so when you turn this off, it won't turn it off together. Um, and different groups makes you, allows you to do different colors, different color temperatures with different lights. But when at the end of the day, when you turn it off, it'll turn it off for everything. So that's the biggest thing with these, especially with, when you start getting this, like the ring light, and then you start getting these lights, it's you're kind of like building an ecosystem of the same light. So this setup is actually really cool. If you're using the ring light and you're looking for some nice RGB background lights, or maybe some kicker lights off the side, you know, I could totally see you getting this pack, you know, maybe using this as a back one, use it as a background light, and maybe using the other one as like a side light, a hair light, a kicker, or something. This pack is really nice, and especially if you're already into the Wii Light ecosystem, just sharing one app to control everything makes the world a lot easier. And I gotta say, I you know, I didn't expect this ring light that I'm using now to be as nice of a quality as it is. I don't typically like ring lights, and I've, I still feel like this could be a little bit softer, but it's, like I said in my review about it, if you haven't seen it, check it out there. But it's it's pretty good. 
And um, this whole setup here with the bag, two light stands, uh, all the hardware you need um, is like 200 bucks. I think it's like 197 on Amazon, which isn't a bad deal considering it comes with everything you need, light stands, the bag and everything. And these lights are nice and light. That if you really need battery power, it takes two Sony NPF style batteries, which is awesome. I love when lights do both battery and the wall because it just gives you more options. This is like an all-in-one. You could just have these plugged into the wall, set up in the spot, put on your stands, just ready to go, go, go. So you get into your YouTube studio, you pull out your smartphone, you turn on your lights, they're all grouped together, boom, they all come on at one time. I mean, it's easy. You just pull open the app and just hit the power button. Boom, everything goes out. Boom, power button, everything goes on. My background light is a different brand, so. When you can make things easier for you, especially when it comes to YouTube, where it's just an on, off, all in the same app, where you can just get in there, you're set up and ready to go, and you can pump out stuff. It makes your life a lot easier as a content creator and a lot easier for you to get where you're going. So I, I think this is sweet, especially if you're using this, all these in one ecosystem, like I said. You can start off with the ring light and you know use that as your key light. Okay, well then maybe you uh, want to move it up in the world, and you uh, can get pick up these as your background lights. So then you you got these as background lights or whatever. Maybe you're maybe you're like, man, I'm really digging this light setup. I want to take my light my lighting to the next level. And then you're, you go for a big cob light with a nice modifier or softbox. Then you're all in the same ecosystem. You got that is your key, the Ninja 400 or whatever is your key light. Then you might use, still use these as your background light, or maybe you use the ring light as your background light. Now you got a kicker and a hair light. I mean, the nice thing about lighting is you always need lights, and you can usually not get too many lights because there's always something you're going to need something for. And you can just you upgrade your ecosystem like that, and it's it's awesome. And you don't have to just jump all at one time into one or the other. You can just you build it up over time. And the nice thing about these packs, like I said, they come with light stands. So, you know, you eventually might want to upgrade to like a nice heavy duty C stand or something. But these packs are made to get you started and get recording now. So that's why I love record, uh, reviewing these type of products is because they're perfect for starters. And as you can see, the quality is there. Got really sweet RGB functionality. I'm in love with RGB lights and I love it when you have an app control. So what else could you really ask for? That's my review of these lights. I think they're fantastic, straight out of the box. I might be doing more videos on these lights in the future. Maybe I'll build up a little kit video and, and do a big demo of all of it together. Hit that like, subscribe button, and do all the fun youtube -y things. And you know that I will see you in the future. Ah, that's a great TV show right there. Oh, oh. Whoa, yeah, cannot wait to continue watching the next episode of Mandalorian, whoa, yeah, that's a lot of action going on right there, woo!